Hey guys, Dr. Kilo Lab Gaming here. Today I'm gonna show you some gameplay with Took, the healer support role character of Hood Outlaws and Legends. Here's just a quick overview of him. So he has the ability instinct, which basically uh, shows you enemies in a certain proximity, so you can see their outlines. And you can also heal uh, your uh, teammates that are close range with the ability at the same time. Then he has like as a gear that he carries with him is like either a gas, so it drains his stamina, or it can also be a healing gas. Then he's traded with fire, which allows him to recover a stamina quicker, and his weapon is the flay, so very play very good close uh, up close range as well. Okay, let's quickly have a look at the perks, and I'm gonna give you my take on them. So what I think for his first perk that I used is Innate Insight, which is basically like the ability meter is fully charged at the beginning of the game already. So, and I chose that one because it's very useful to have that straight away, because the ability is basically you can see the em enemies in a certain proximity and you can heal teammates that are close to you. So it's good to have that straight away, so you have it straight away at hand whenever you need it. So I think that one is a, a good perk for him to have, to play him as intended, because he's the supported role to have this ability straight away in the game, so you can use it like as soon as you need it. So therefore I think this one is a, a pretty good one to use in terms of, of playing him how he's intended to be played. So the other perks of course are also potentially useful. It's completely up to you how you like to use him. But I think this is probably the best one on how he's intended to be played. Then as a second one I use the medicinal potion which is basically his potion. He normally has a gas that drains enemy stamina which can be good in certain situations. But I think again because he's the supportive character and the healer it's better to use this one which basically makes this uh, stamina draining gas it turns it into a healing gas so you can heal your teammates so here I, again i think it's very good to use this because it's good to keep your teammates alive as long as you can so you have the ability to do so and then on top of that you have extra gas which you can actually help to keep your your teammates uh, health up and therefore keep them longer in the game so therefore i think again like this one is probably the best one to use to play took how he's intended to be played and again to keep your teammates as long as possible within the game so you can use your ability on one hand to heal them and then as said you have this extra extra medicinal potion that can can keep them actually in game for even longer specifically in these situations when you're extracting this is very useful so yeah that's why, why i chose that one so as the third perk i chose vampirian a uh, vampiric bludgeon which is basically a percentage of the melee attack damage dealt to each individual enemy is absorbed and converted into health so again here i think it's very useful because as said it's with Took, I see it like you should stay in the game as long as you can normally, specifically in these situations where it's getting a bit uh, difficult, like the extraction situation. So when there is the extraction going on, it gets a bit messy sometimes. So the longer you stay in game, um, the more you can obviously help your team out. So you can help them with your ability, so you heal them up, So or they can also see due to your ability also the, the, the enemies in the certain proximity, so it gives you some intel which is also very important. And then you have, of course, like we said already, the gas bomb, which is healing them up as well. So this one caters towards that because it heals you. So it gives you a bit more extra health when you're in this close range fight situations because his flail is strong, so it's not that he can't fight. So you can be in these fights. It helps you to heal you, uh, yourself up again. Then you can maybe retreat a bit, be behind your, your, your uh, teammates and heal them up again. So you have to stay longer in the game. And that's why I think this one is very good. Yeah, here just quickly to show you, there is also a clothing section in your uh, camp where you can go to and then change the appearance of your character, of Took here in this case, of course. And also the same for your weapon. So you can unlock it and then with in-game money you can buy it. And to just quickly sum it up, so like I said, he is the healer support role character of Hood Outlaws and Legends. Very good in close range fighting, his flail is pretty strong. And yeah, his healing abilities are really good, really useful, really helpful. So stay close to your teammates so that you can actually help them out in terms of when it comes to an actual uh, fight in that sense, because he is strong close range. But also keep your distance at times so you can heal them if necessary and use your ability to give your, your team basically the advantage. Yeah, so I'm going to do a, a series of gameplay videos and we're going to start with Took. So let's get into it. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, 
so here uh, some gameplay with uh, Took. It's actually a whole match. I'm just gonna play the match. I'm not gonna talk over it, so you can actually experience the raw material how it was. I played with some randoms here, and yeah, let's go. Okay. State granted. Gearbox here. There's a guy on me, guys. There's a Robin. Good, 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 good. Careful, there's a Robin somewhere as well. Man. <laughs> ah, crap. Okay, they're still around the bridge.
Okay, nice, good job. Okay guys, take out the key. Yeah, so you need to keep my ah, they got the A as well. Fuck. Can you get B? Okay, we get A as well, that's nice. Get B as well. Good job man. the bottom floor Fascinating. From behind. Fascinating. Okay. Ah, shit, it's close now, man. Fascinated, are you fucking killing kidding me? Come on guys. Guys, they're bringing it down to the docks, come on. We have to go. They're over there. They dropped it already. to get a uh, 
Yeah, it took looks very interesting. The whole outfit and everything and the customization. It's very interesting. Choice. Oh. Assassinations are also quite interesting. Ah. Very soft like this one for example. The priest can't kill. Yeah, <laughs> it's necessary. Should I stop? GG guys. <gasps> Fuck man. <laughs> I thought we had it man. Oh crap, they taking A man, that's not good. That was it. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm also planning on doing or showing you some gameplay with the other characters, with Robin, Marianne and with John. And yeah, later on I also want to do some gameplay dissection videos where I go into depth about uh, my gameplay to see where I could have done something maybe differently, where something went really well to help myself reflect and get better at the game and potentially to help also you to, to improve the, your gameplay. So I'm gonna, gonna keep doing that, really enjoy the game. And yeah, I'm also doing creating some content for other other games like Hunt Showdown and uh, others like you can see on my channel. So if you like, just leave a like <laughs> and maybe subscribe would be very appreciated. So thank you for watching and yeah, see you soon guys and overall stay healthy. So thank you very much guys. <laughs>